Hey everyone, it's Rhythone, and um, hey, welcome back to the Horizon server, and it's, did it finally stop? No, it's raining again. It's nighttime, so let's, um, ooh, did I actually place the block? I don't think so. No, carpenter's beds plus that. So, did a little bit of remodeling around the house, put in the nifty vibrant quartz glass, um, some nice little carpets down, little walkway up to the flower boxes, and then hop on up, you get a nice little view of the village, sit that, right, you can just walk on out. I'm sure that's because of step assist, but, uh, yeah. There we go, so come on down here, lovely carpet, and, uh, you're not supposed to see that yet. These are a work in progress. But, once they're complete, I'll have a quick teleport back over to the factory. Aha! Uh, see, so this is all the same, but, uh, as you can see, I have access to my terminal. So let's, uh, put that back on. And, uh, there we go. Quick little hidden ME access terminal. There we go. Very nice. A uh, couple more paintings. Just spiff, spiff the place up a little bit. And then, uh, I thought since I had a nice little house, I would put it in a nice little library. Yeah, all sorts of books and everything I could ever want to read. I have to put a couple other things in. I'm not really sure. But it's nice for now. Um, that is about it around the house. But I'm excited to say that we should be just about ready, if not ready, for the pebble bed reactor. Oh god, you guys are still running. Let's clean this up real quick, and uh, I think we're done. So, where's the one that's planting? Did he bugger off anyways? No, wait. You. No more. So those should just finish growing real quick, and then he'll put them away. Did I get the wrong one? Yep, I got the wrong one. Okay, let's put down the correct golem. Use, gather. And, uh, there you go. Get back to it. So I needed spruce wood. I probably have way more than I need. Totally forgot I had that going. Oops. Why aren't you chopping? I don't want to pick it up. Armor. Which one's magnetism? This one? Okay. There. I should walk over closer now. You can pick all that stuff up. Cool. Okay, so let's let that finish up and just toss everything back in the system. And, uh, spoilers, spoilers, so I did figure out the problem with the beacons too, and it's all because I am kind of noobish when it comes to vanilla Minecraft, so let's check that out real quick, because I left one to do on camera. Beacons are going, and the problem was, they need to be able to see the sky. So, enclosing them in this building didn't work. Now, take just a minute, and of course, obsidian is just the, the fastest material in the world to, to mine here. So, we'll get this cleaned up, and then... Uh, They'll all be powered up, and we can give them abilities and whatnot if we really wanted to. So, any time now, there we go. Alright, and I turned the graphic settings down a little bit, but it got the frames per second up. And then we can right-click you, give you an emerald, and I uh, want speed. Done. And we have speed now, too. 
and particle effects. But let's check out the range. We okay. So we are just a speed demon still working all the way over here. Zero and it wore off. Just curious. Because I don't actually know the range on these. Here. Okay, so it's probably 16. Eh, well, good enough. You can get a little boost of it when you come through here. Yep. So, what we want to check. And yeah, I kind of moved all the freeloaders around so everyone has a little job to keep her eye on the rooms. We got Stan working in the IT department, and you're not showing anything yet. Hang on. Um, iron out, iron in. Bam. Fixed. Excellent. So, that all looks good. Let's check and see. Spruce, spruce, spruce. Oh. Yep. We're good. Okay. Good thing I turned them off. Okay. So, so we got him, we got Glacius ready for when we start our uh, fire. Right. Um, when we start genetics, keep everything nice and cold. And in here, we should be about full up. Let's check. Full, 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 fantastic. Well, all but one full. So, we can go ahead and break these for the time being, because it's a little bit different of a setup. Now that we've got all the carbon dioxide gas in there, it is a closed loop. We don't need any of this. Go. And let's harvest these up. Whoops. Breaking the walls. Ruining the illusion. There we go. Okay. So... Why are you glitched? Whatever. We're gonna need a couple things, so let's get over... We need the work table, so it's up here. We should have just about everything we need to get this made. Toshi's keeping an eye on things, making sure we run well. Now, we're gonna need some steel for this, and we are gonna need piping. And I don't have enough liquid pipe, so I know I'm going to need glass then. There we go. Put a stack of that. And for pipe. Uh, maybe not if I do this right. There we go. There's too many pipes. Fine. Um, besides, I think it's gas duct anyways. Gas duct. Whoa, what happened? There we go. Hardened clay and glass. Oh, see, I didn't even need to make pipe anyways. Cool. Go away. Um, 50 hardened clay. Well, we don't need a lot of these, so that'll work just fine. Just go... Do, 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 do. And... Do, do, do. Oh, yeah. 32 should be more than enough. Let's make a stack. Alright, clean this up. Put these away. And that and that. Why is my right? Magnet mode. Okay. So now that the armor's back on. Head down here. Wow. Okay. So the heated comes in there. The cool carbon dioxide comes down here. Let me make sure that we can fit. I just need to connect this like so. Up. Go back 
up. There we go. So we got the cooled carbon dioxide there. We'll go ahead and get rid of these. And there we go. So let's grab some more of the futuristic armor plating. Fix the floor here. Put those away. And I don't need that charcoal or that lever. I might regret putting the lever back later. There we go. Very nice. I'm going to put some carpenter's blocks. Okay, so then the heated is going to come out of the top. And then all that will be left is our fuel pellets. Yeah. Oh. Yep. Ta-da. Okay. And that is pretty much the whole setup. We're going to be generating intense amounts of power from this. Now we need our steam boiler. Just one. The steam boiler is going to go here. Now, are you going to pick up heat from... No. Okay, good. Because that would have made everything change a little bit. Just a little. So, now I'm not sure if I need to insulate this, I probably do, so should we go with some more of that block? Yeah, why not? We have, we've got yellow block. It is hot. Warning. Oh, that's right. This will help silence that too, won't it? Cool. Let's just encapsulate this real quick. Neat. Okay. Maybe if we go with the... We don't need to access that anymore either. And the steam's going to come out of the top. So if we go like this... What do you think? It looks terrible. I try. Okay, so then we're going to need our steam pipes, and I think this is even enough room for me to set up the awesome, the turbine. So let's grab some steam. Steam line. Oh, yeah, that would have been disastrous, actually. One minor detail is that requires water as well. So, so we just want some conduit, pressurized fluid, conduit, right there. single piece. And where's my wrench? I'm going to need to adjust my GUI. If you look in the bottom left, you can actually almost see it when you hold the get wrench, and you can switch through. So power mode, can't see anything, there's no power lines in here. Got redstone mode, item conduit, fluids, ME, and all. Go. So you fill up how quick? I want to see. Tank zero empty. Do I have to fill you from the bottom, don't I? <clears throat> In which case... Oh wait, um... Fluid conduit, insert mode. Go. Okay, go. No. Or it could be that the steam boiler, or the, uh, hmm... Well, let's do a quick experiment here. Uh, whatever. Just put this here. Steam line? No. Another one of those ones you don't get back. Okay, good to know. And if I grab the wrench and shift and click, let's see. Extract, insert. 
you're only going to take it. Okay. So let's rethink this a little bit. Can you? So that's going to have to be a different type. I don't think I can hook the pump up to that. Um. It's going to be more noise. Uh, that's okay, I guess. Get that one there. I know. We can hide it mostly. I'll just do it right here. Just need a, a two by two. So let's actually do it here, just like that one. This one we're going to bury. So, let me dig down just a little bit. Let's do this. Dig, dig, dig. Okay, so that should work. We'll just kind of pop this out. I know, I know, but I'm charging as I go, so it's not like it really matters that I'm using this for dirt. Um, so this will be more than good enough. Let's... See, I need a DC engine. Do I have any left? Ah, I've got one left. And I should have a pump in here too, I think. Yep, good. Okay, so that and that. I've got my water. We're going to need some fluid pipe, which I think we came to the... We're out completely. No, it's liquid, isn't it? It's liquid. Liquid tank, upgrade module, do 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 Um... No, no, it's right in front of me, liquid pipe. So we did need that steel and the... glass. So let's go make this, we'll throw the pump down, We'll make this work. It needs a lot of water anyways, so it's probably safer this way. Oh, down here. Okay, so glass. Do, 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 do. And HSLA. Do, 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 do. Always use enough of that. Okay, so take this back, clean this up. All right, let's move on. Okay, so moving along here, let's hop down. Grab my water bucket. Deactivate. Yeah, okay, good. So we'll hop down here, and just because I noticed it, I don't need you right this second. Do, do, do. Blop. Okay. So, I'm going to have the water pool be there. I'm going to pump over. And up through here. So let's pop down one, two, three. Just gonna be on this level here. I'll just go straight in and let's see. Okay, so we're this is taking too long. Yep. I did that. There we go. Perfect. So the pump can just send it right through. So let's just grab, I've got that hardened clay still. Go. So like this. And I don't really need that, which is why I'm not caring. Okay. So one, two, three, four, like that. Just go ahead and fill this up. Now I want to make sure that this is going to be enough. Like that. Like that. Like that, I hope. Let's see. Oh, remember that lever I put back? I could use that right now. Empty. 
let's no, not the wrench and the screwdriver for this. Doop, there we go. Had it spun. It's usually what happens. Now I just want to make sure the water can keep up. Let's shrink on down here. Now these aren't multi-block as far as I can tell. So you gotta stay give yourself enough room. Get back up. And ow, ow, what? We're stuck. Let's see, aim for that block. Dang it. Ah, uh, well, I like this. I still can't get to it. Oh. And now uh, break it off. Defeats the purpose. Oh well. Okay, now we're out. So, back to what we were doing. Oops. And I didn't think those would connect. Tank empty. <sighs> and you have to go in from underneath, aren't you? Let's check. Yep. Underneath. Okay. It's not impossible. Um, actually, it's not hard at all. Just break that. Grab that. Put, uh, do, do, do this and this away for now. Actually, I'll probably need this. Go like that. I'll extend those up. We need to get ourselves a shaft. And I think, uh, do, 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 do. I'll my angular transducer. Let me just double check that we're not going to break this. As far as I know, steel can handle it. I'll put it in. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Not a problem. This and we'll prep this since we need it anyways. And like that. Nope. And that's why I knew that we'd need that. There we go. And just to make sure. Yep. Receiving. Perfect. So then just back up. Like so. We hook up the steam boiler. We'll get our liquid pipes back out and blop, blop, ta-da! Okay, good. So, with that all set up, and uh, do I have any more? Yep, cool. Helps if you put stuff away and take it back out. Cool. Cover that back up. Insulate this, because I'm pretty sure that will help. I know. With reactor craft, the laws of I will the same thermodynamic dynamic laws apply. So that and that and water looks good. It's keeping up. This one is draining like crazy. But is it keeping up? Up. The last thing I want to do is overheat anything. Oh, but this is going to be returning water back into the system. Anyways, once we get that hooked up, we're going to need a lot more water. But, for the time being, this would be good. Let's, um, just because the pipes like to glitch out visually, I'm just going to hide that. Some more of these blocks. Ta-da! Maybe I should make that out of the orange ones. That's okay. So, now appears to be the good time to get our turbine and steam grate set up. So let's... We're going to need a lot of steel for this. Grab some steel. We'll grab the gears. And that. Uh, Bet you it's also gonna need some 
other stuff here, but let's, oops, let's put away all this random stuff out of the bag there. Okay, so I'll grab that steel back. Here we go. We'll put back that and that and that and that. Perfect. Okay. So. Turbine. Compound turbine or turbine? React craft turbine. React craft turbine. So we're going to need propeller blades, and we need five of these. So propeller blades, 40 of those. The power blade is made out of shaft, base panel, and ingot stuff at like that. I've got plenty of those. We're going to need more shafts. And we are going to need base panels, 35. We have most of everything we need here. Let's see, base panels, get three apiece, just toss that in there. Need 40 of those, so that'll work. And then we need two, perfect. Grab all those. That, that, that. And just an ingot, we've got plenty of that. Anything else we're going to need? Combine turbine. These turbines, which are more need one, so we need five compound, so ten turbines, and five shaft cores. Turbines are once again okay. So we're taking this turbine and we're turning it. Got it. So compound turbine is made of two turbines. We're going to need a lot of these. It's okay. So we're going to start off by making for power blades and these. Oh, it's just a standard crafting recipe. Even better. Well, then let's make up a few more base panels because that way we can make up enough. So total, we need a 40 for that, a 5. Then we need to add two more turbines for each, so 10 times 8, so another 80. We need 120 turbine blades. Well, I used up all the steel. Make a few more base panels, because I know for a fact we're going to need a lot here. There we go. Besides, I don't mind having extra. Okay, so that, that. Now. We need 120 of these. I made 35. We have no more stealing. It's which I believe should be excellent. Those are still ready to go. The beauty about that one filling up is we have a backlog. And in times like this, it's incredibly useful. So we've got 36. So let's make this a full stack. Oh, come on. Stack. And then 26. We need more shafts. Okay, so. Doot, doot, doot. I knew I didn't have enough of everything. Okay, so that should be enough. Those, go back and grab these. So for 120... So we've got 104. We need more base panels. do. Grab this again. Okay, so this was more crafting than I had originally intended for, but that's okay. 
Let's see, 56, right? Yeah. And then, compound turbines are two turbines. So almost everything but the final project, for the pro final product. Yep. Okay, so let's just throw this all in here. Excellent. And grab the turbine. So we need two of these. And what are we missing? Shaft cores. There we go. And I probably made too many of those. That's okay. Nope. Actually, I think I might have been good. So, I'm still missing something here. Let me look. So, for turbine, it needs a compressor. Okay. So, and I'm going to need a lot more steel. See, this is very steel intensive. And uh, that'll do for now. I'll check the video length and we might call it. But this could just be to be continued. So how many compressors we gonna need? We need turbine. So we need a total of... Let's just make a batch. Four should be good, I think. Compound turbine. turbine. Check cores. Okay, so let's do this. One and two. And it's two per. So we need a total of ten. Okay. So I undershot on the total number of compressors needed. Five and six, there we go. And we grab the turbines. Ten. Then let's make a compound turbine like that. five compound turbines, and then I just need the 40 propeller blades, and let's make this. Oh, moonstones. So these are really cool. Um, and then I should grab a rotational that Well, it's going to take a little bit to heat up, so we'll come back to this. Now I think I need to actually go up one more. And for that, I guess I will need more factory blocks. I've got an idea. It's a lot more shiny metal construction than I needed, but let's see if we can't make this look a little fancy. Got this column block, right? Go to here. There we go. And this should be four should be dead center. Fantastic. One. Oh. Well, hopefully. Let's see. Two. I might have to drop it down one. Yep. Okay, so this, hopefully, one. Now it won't, now it won't attach. Oh, maybe there was enough room. Let's see. Two, three, four, and five. Wow. It's huge. Now, I gotta make sure people stay back, because these will break. So, let's see here. Grab these. That's not going to be enough. I've got plenty of other blocks to chisel. And then some... Some glass. There we go. So... Go like this. Okay, cool. 
cool. We'll just center it like that. One, two, three, four. And that should be more than enough. We'll just come to the center of this one. Because it's going to... Man, I hope I can use this for something. I hope I didn't just make all this excess power that I'm not going to be able to do anything with. Well, if that's the case, I'll find a way to do something with it, and that'll be another project. There we go. Just like that. So, I can glass that up later. Now, do I have any rotational dynamos? I do, actually. Let's just grab those. I don't think this is it's going to be way too much power for that to put out. Um, well, you get the idea. Let's get this scheme going. Oh no, I still got them. Excellent, right here. Steam lines. Oh, and the steam, great. Steam, great. And the next episode, we'll make the fuel pellets. We'll deal with this excess steam that we're going to have. Which is going to come out over here, and we'll have to keep it from going everywhere. Hey, look, iron ore. Ooh, not that, you know, we need any more on top of our so many thousands, but hey. Iron is iron. Go through here go, and then we'll have the steam lines come out and down through the floor and over to here, and then up. This should work, I hope. Boing. Okay. So. Great. And hitboxes. It fully insulates the steam boiler, but now you can't see it. That's the downside. Okay, so here, come on down, run you through here, pop on out. Ah, we got dirt to work against. Ta da! And that didn't work. Uh, cobble. Dang it. Boing. Okay. There, to there, to there. Oops. One too many. And broke one too many that time, too. I suppose I could just set the steam grate into the ground. Yeah. That looks cool. Okay. So then we'll glass this up. We'll come back next time. We'll get this all ready to go. And, um,. I'm going to need a lot more of these, because I believe this thing puts out enough to power 15 at once. And then we'll just uh, stick it to the back here, and call it good. Maybe do something like this. Let's see. Let's see, so we're going to take it all the way up, huh? Yeah, we'll take this all the way up to the ceiling, so let's just bat form it. Do something like this. Well, that's going to be for another time because that's going to not going to be enough room. Anyways, snap on back here. Then Rhythone. Thanks for joining me here on the Horizon server. Leave me likes, comments. Uh, comments are awesome. Let me know what you think. If you've got any other ideas, maybe something to make this look a little cooler. That'd be great. Um, and then once again, thanks for watching. I'll catch you next time. Bye-bye.